Hey everybody and welcome back. If you haven't been here before, my name is Mary. Today I'm going to be talking about a series that it's the first book in the series. I've been waiting for it for a while. It is a spin-off of a series that I just absolutely loved, and that was the Wicked Winter series by Scarlett Scott. I love the winters. Um, absolutely adored that series. Really, really enjoyed it. So the spin-off is about the Sutton family, which you got to meet, um, who are kind of the rivals, um, enemy type thing in the Wicked Winter series. And so this series is the Simple Sutton series, a lot of S's there, um, by Scarlett Scott. Again, historical romance, you know, with Scarlett Scott. Um, the first book is Sutton's Spinster, which <clears throat> is about Jasper Sutton. Again, if you'll remember Jasper, he is the head of the family, um, head of the Suttons. He is the oldest. He is in charge of their, they run a gaming hell. And he meets Lady Octavia Alexander, which she's eccentric. Again, she is um, Maribel's sister who married Damien Winter in the Wicked Winters. And she is kind of eccentric, um, doesn't want to get married, doesn't, uh, just wants to start a gossip column of sorts. Um, and she wants Jasper to be her partner because he owns the gaming hell and she feels that she can get a lot of information on the um, the gentry. So she kind of make a long story short, I don't want to give anything away, but she drives him crazy, keeps telling her no, but eventually <clears throat> things happen. Um, I love Jasper. I absolutely do. Jasper was one of my favorites even in the Wicked Winter series. I loved reading about Jasper. Because again, he's that bad guy with that that good um, that little bit of good in him that always redeems himself, and I just I just love him, and um, so happy to get his story in this book. And I love Lady Octavia. Um, I didn't think though that in this book, um, once you got halfway in, that you saw a lot of um, the things that made her what she was. I think, because but again. I still liked it. I really, really enjoyed the book. I wish it was longer, but with Scarlett Scott's books, um, they're really quick reads, but really, really good reads. Um, I just loved it. Um, couldn't wait. Actually, I was kind of upset because, you know, I had gotten it, pre-ordered it, and it was delivered to my Kindle, and I didn't even realize it was there. And, um, happened to see it and I'm like, oh, I'm a week late. It you know, came out last week. So, but I got it. I read it. I really enjoyed it. I can't wait for the next book in the series, which is Rafe's story, which is Sutton's, you know, Jasper Sutton's brother. Um, there are several brothers and sisters in this family. So this is probably going to still be like a, you know, five, six, possibly longer book series. Um, cause we've got a missing brother that is kind of showing up and, or they think it's him, not sure. Um, again, if you've read The Wicked Winters, you know what I'm talking about with the um, brother that supposedly died. But again, I enjoyed it. And and again, if you, um, if you read Scarlet Scott, you do know that her books are a little scorching. Um, a lot of scorching romance there, a lot of scenes that um, are, um, pretty hot. So that's something to think about, you know, when you read these books. If you're wanting like really clean read, um, her books are not for you. She, uh, she writes some pretty scorching, um, hot material in her books. But I, again, loved it. Loved Jasper. Loved, um, Octavia. And I'm, I'm really hoping, um, that the series goes in the way Wicked Winters where the whole series is really good for me because it seems like it's going to be. Um, you'll get a, a taste of um, what Rafe's story is going to be about with the governess, and uh, I think I'm going to enjoy that a whole lot. So I do wish, though, and I don't know if anybody else is no noticing this in books, but there are so many typos anymore. 
with this one not so many but you know they were there you know you have Octavia she's getting called Olivia and things like that I mean I think that's becoming um, a problem with books I mean you know I don't know if proofreaders are just not really doing their job or you're not getting them proofread I, I don't know but in the last probably almost all of the books that I've read I have found typos and errors and just just things it doesn't like make the book terrible for me but it does um, does bother me a little bit but yeah I just don't know it seems like a trend I didn't notice it you know in years gone by I didn't notice um, that many errors in books I'd see them here or there but lately it's all over the place you know so don't know if anybody else is, is noticing any of that but um, it kind of bugs me a little bit but Anywho, I just wanted to talk today about, you know, this new series that I'm, I'm sure is going to be really good because Scarlett Scott is really good. She writes, um, to me, really interesting stories, really interesting, you know, characters, and I absolutely love reading her. So really looking forward to the rest of this series. But I know this is not Halloween related too, but, you know, come out, I'm going to read it and, um, just want to tell you how much I enjoyed it and that um, if you're a fan of Scarlett Scott and you like her books, um, just let you know that this is the first book in this new series and I really enjoyed it. So with that, I am going to go, but until I see you guys next time, you know, hey, happy reading.